Big operation. Thank you, Tammy, so much. This is big, too. Put her name on the wall. Tonight, people all over the country are trying to get recognition for Wauwatosa Police Officer Jennifer Sabina. She was killed while on duty, but the people who run a national memorial in D.C. say she is ineligible for inclusion. Ben Handelman is live in Tosa to explain why. Good evening, and Jennifer Sabina was gunned down on Christmas Eve day. The suspect is her husband, and that relationship is why one national group say they have rejected from putting her name on a national memorial. She was shot several times as she left the Wauwatosa Fire Department early Christmas Eve morning, her own service weapon used to kill her. While Wauwatosa officer Jennifer Sabina was killed on duty, a national organization is refusing to add her name to a wall recognizing fallen police officers who die on the job. It was very unfortunate to hear that. Uh, I, I was actually stunned. Brian Doro is a former instructor of Sabina's. He says the application was rejected because the National Law Enforcement Officers Memorial Fund has classified the death as a domestic situation. The suspect is Sabina's husband. She was on duty. Her husband ended up being the suspect, but she was killed on duty while performing her duties as a police officer. Doro is part of a growing list of people who are now trying to change the decision, a list growing with mouse clicks. Right now it's gaining over 10 signatures a minute. I don't know what's going on on Facebook, but it seems to be going viral. Jason Aslin started an online petition in hopes the memorial will reconsider. Yeah, I'm seeing the signatures on here from California, Florida, Nevada. I mean, it's incredible. Aslin is a South Milwaukee native who now lives in Michigan. He spends his free time helping the families of officers killed on duty around the country, which now includes Jennifer Sabina. In the end, I just want to see her put on the wall give her the respect she deserves. Wisconsin Attorney General J.B. Van Hollen is also weighing in. He sent a formal letter seeking change. Wisconsin's largest police union says failure to add Sabina may strain relationships with the group who frequently fundraises in our state. She died in the line of duty. She was on duty. It was a tragedy. And if there are any changes, they will likely come tomorrow. That is when I am told the national board for this memorial has a regularly scheduled meeting, and they will put the final touches on who they will add to the wall this year. Now, if you would like to sign your name to the petition, we've added it at fox6now.com. We're live at the Wauwatosa Police Department. Ben Handelman, Fox 6 News. She was clearly on duty when she died. Do we know what the criteria are to be put onto this wall if someone dies of natural causes while on duty? Would that count, for example? Yeah, and we had those questions today, and we called this national memorial several times. Our calls went unreturned. Ben Handelman reporting live tonight. Thanks. Uh, to a story.